Alright, we're back with Frolic to Godlike, wrapping up the Jibbo and Ryan Hunter play session. So, uh, there's gonna be just three more matches that are remaining from that session, and we're just gonna jump right in. Okay, another match with Ryan Hunter, or Ryan Hunter, Jibbo, because I guess, I guess he, Ryan didn't join up in the lobby yet at this point, or maybe he joined in and he's just last in the queue. Honestly, not much more to say for me to, s or for me to say at this point, because I, Mostly because I'm still unfamiliar with uh with most of these characters. But um Yeah, I'm getting completely destroyed. I tag off my forward throw, not a smart idea. Now that I think about it, I should really be tagging after a backward throw because his forward throw puts my opponent right in front of me, and that's not good at all. Poison's uppercut doesn't seem all that great, and it knocks me far away, but uh I hear you can you can combo off of it off the tag, but you know it looks really hard. Builds up counter hit, nothing. He misses that low grab because I stood up just in time. That was probably lucky, honestly. They look uh, the startup looks visually the same, I think. Or no 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 that one that one's a stomp. He like he stomps the ground a little bit. All right. He seems to be a little more aggressive with this. He's using his fast fireball as, a, as opposed to his uh, slow moving one. There's a slow one right there. Kind of a tick throw. I wonder why I did that. I don't typically use EX fireball. Uppercut into Kazuya. I actually catch it this time. Poison's on her last legs. I actually get the round. Honestly, I think that's the only round I ever get this entire session. So, uh, I'm celebrating a little bit on the inside at this point. <sighs> that's really reckless of me. I probably should have saw it, because he was backing up just to get the spacing right on that EX... I don't even know what to call that. I get my combo. <sighs> I don't know why I get standing around house. I want to say there's a little bit of a lag spike, but maybe my hand slipped, I don't know. That was just really dumb of me. EX Fireball to get through the projectile pressure. Honestly, that's probably not the smartest thing I could have done. I don't know, maybe it was smarter than just random Tatsu. That was, that was not supposed to be EX Donkey, that was supposed to be a cross cancel. For uh, Alpha Connor. Ryu's on his last legs, oh no! I get EX sure you can on accident. Since I didn't get the first hit, I don't get a hard knockdown, so I have to settle for the, the bad tag. And he gets like, what, three standing heavies into his uppercut? It's pretty funny looking, actually. This bitch slaps me like six times in a row. I should've blocked. You, the best thing to do is actually not to block an uppercut, but to bait it if you can. So you can get punished. Because if they block, if you block it, then they're allowed to tag off of it and be safe for the most part. But you know. Um, prolonging the inevitable so bad. There's nothing I could do at this point, I don't think. Clock's winding down. I'm like, got no health. I'm doing alright damage, I'm chasing him down, but... At this point, there's really nothing. He, uh, he doesn't have to do anything, but he does anyway, just for the hell of it. Alright, we have our next match. Ryan Hunter made it back into the lobby. He gets a weird counter hit thing on me again. Counter hit step into... Is that a command? That's not a command grab. It's some kind of animation. I don't know how it works. I gotta study Julia. I'm trying to play a little more uh, careful with my footsies right here, as you can tell, but catch my raw launcher because he's going for those lows a lot, it looks like. Get an overhead. I really don't think you can confirm off that overhead for Kazuya. I could have done EX slaughter hook there. Nothing came out. That was terrible. There's one thing I, I learn now that I'm watching this, like maybe two weeks later, is that I have to uh, k start learning how to maximize my damage on meterless combos. Well, what I mean by that is usually like cross rushes, boost combos. I think I think that's what they call cross rushes. But um, I got to start working on those because I usually with Ryu I usually do like crouching medium punch, crouching medium kick, and donkey kick as my confirm when I should really be doing it into like launcher or something. Because that way I can guarantee at least get more than a few hundred damage. And that confirm was a, or that cancel was late on the overhead, so I pay for it. Uh. 
Alright, second round going in. It's like every time I go for a crouching medium kick, they just have to jump in on me. You hear that, I'm just really slow to react. It's probably that. And that's my poor attempt at a hit confirm. <laughs> I probably could have done it into a cross rush at, at that point, honestly. Actually, I probably should have done that instead. Getting completely bodied. He misses his combo, but uh, missed an uppercut, which is just bad. I would have lost either way. And I don't anti air because I'm honestly that's my biggest bad habit right now. Is I'm too scared to ha anti air. So there's that. Okay, last match of the video. We uh. Alright, trying to be a little more careful, because, you know, Ryan Hunter's probably the person that played the most out of this entire session, obviously. Trying to be real careful. I'm not exactly sure if Julia's high capabilities, but I know he can get quite a bit off his lows, so I'm trying to be a little, I guess, uh, protective of my toes, I guess. I'm not sure I'm going for the sweep. Maybe he's just trolling me? I'm not sure. Oof. He's going for the kill here. I'm guessing he's going to use the meter again. No. He's just going to try and... Ooh, I don't know why I did that. That's kind of... Oh no! Why did I do that? Ooh, that was so dumb of me. He gave me enough breathing room for me to actually try and do something smart, but... Oh, so much hit stun. Oh my goodness. Upsy daisy. Uh... This, at this point, ooh, there's my punish, and I missed my combo, shoot, I should've kept it simple. That was probably supposed to be an electric, but I, you know, at that point I took it again. Okay, I got one electric, but yeah, saves Julia with a cross rush. My electrics have been really been suffering uh, with execution lately, and there's another weird kind of hit animation right there, I've never seen that before. Okay. Ah, see, activate cross assault and CPU Kazu uses all my meter. I don't need. <laughs> I tried using cross assault to save me some health, but in the end, it ended up kind of backfiring. Well, kind. I guess you could say it backfired, but Kazu used all my meter when I could have been doing some more stupid stuff, buying some time, maybe chipping him out a little bit. But real quick match, and I guess we're done. I know sumo wrestlers with more staying power. Okay, so here's the results. This should come as no surprise to anybody. I got completely bodied today. Or er, that session. Out of all the matches that I played, all probably eight or nine matches, I only got one round in. And these guys are definitely no joke. Uh, I think I like to think I leveled up a little. I did some tactics I've never done before. Um, I was learning a little bit more of the matchups and my footies improved a little bit. So hopefully uh, after this you get to see me improve a lot more on Father Tagala. So until next time, I'll see you later. This is Alex Vega, New Radical from ThankYouForPlaying.com and Vega.